Hey guys, this is John and Ben. And Ben, what do you got, Ben? I got a dinosaur. Ooh, what's your dinosaur's name? Daddy Duty. Daddy Duty. And what's on your shirt over here? A dinosaur. Dinosaurs. What does your dinosaur do? Anything cool? Um, he roars. He roars. Wow. Well, hey, I I wanted to do a little show and tell myself here along with Ben. Take a look at this silver one ounce bar. I just think these things are really cool. Um, they, they're from this company, Prospectors Golden Gems. Uh, the owner here, David Emil, he's actually been featured on some uh, TV shows. I think one of them is Reclaimed. There's another one, I believe. He owns his own refinery. You could send him scrap, uh, and he can send you cash, or he can send you bars, okay? He can send you silver. Or uh, whatever else you got coming to him, he can purify it, refine it, and, and and get you whatever you need. But anyways, take a look at what he's done here. It's a one-ounce silver bar, poured style. He's got his stamp. You know, he stamps a one troy ounce, 999. And uh, then he's got a, a, a like a, a die, a coin that he made. Uh, with the help of Daniel Carr, I'm sure you've heard of Daniel Carr. A lot of Daniel's uh, stuff is pretty collectible. But anyway, so he's got his company name, Prospector's Golden Gems, Colorado. He's got the year 2020. And so then, then they press that die into this bar. It's like a proof-like surface. Hey, hey, Ben, can you uh, dial it down just a little bit, please? Thank you. Uh, so, I mean, just look at this. It's got the tentacles, really cool design. On the, on the back, on the reverse, he stamped it, and, and he's got them numbered, and he's got this little certificate that he signs. Uh, so apparently this is the second year for these. The first year he made a limited run of 100. Uh, this year he's made... He says 500. I uh, managed to buy a bunch of these, and they come, and they kind of, these little blister packs bust, but uh, just very cool. I'm going to kind of uh, match up the uh, certs with the number, put them in my own little packaging. I'm going to save a few. I'm going to uh, flip a few. I just think these are really cool. Uh, man, do I love this design or what? What could you do? I mean, take take this design and just expand it. You know, what else are you going to do? You're going to take uh, uh, maybe some of those classic silver commemoratives, those classic silver commemoratives, uh, make a die, and then stamp that. You can do one ounce, two ounce. I mean, the, the key here is getting that surface to be proof. I mean, look how deep. Look how far that, that die is pushed in there. It's pretty deep. It's pretty strong. And it gives it that kind of mirrored proof-like surface. Just a really cool idea. I think it's revolutionizing. Think about all these little uh, island colonies that, you know, whether it's Perth Mint or, that, or um, you know, whatever mint and, and like an island like Tuvalu where they have like... Uh, you know, they'll have a coin or they'll have, they'll put something in there like a, a floor, four leaf clover or, or a pearl or a shark's tooth, a meteor. You know, all these things have been thought of and designed, but as simple as taking like a new, making a die and stamping it into this and then date it, you know, put the date on there. I just think that it's so freaking cool. Maybe, maybe I'm alone on this. Maybe I'm not. Nonetheless, I thought I figured I'd share. I appreciate you guys watching the video. Take care. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.